Hey guys, Mary Jam, so 4.54 on February 13th, so I was just talking about the Japanese guy that I've been watching that I kind of have a crush on, <clears throat> but it's just a crush, but anyways, um, it's kind of helping me learn Japanese because it's subtitles, and then, um, he's talking in Japanese so you could kind of hear it, and then he's showing his life, being a single guy and Japan in his 40s, so this is him, so I can't even pronounce his name, <laughs> I know it's pretty bad, but again, it's just a crush, but I'm just showing, showing you guys who I like now, because I like a lot of YouTubers, <laughs> also, um, trying to promote it, so, uh, his name is, I can't even pronounce it, but a n a g u r a man a anagara anagara so yeah <laughs> i can't even say his name <laughs> so yeah that's the guy that i like the well, the newest guy that i like <laughs> so i'm hooked on his channel so hopefully you go check him out like i said it's not just because i have a crush on him it's neat seeing japan and his life as a simple person, right? So, um, but yeah, I have a lot of questions on guys <laughs> on YouTube. <laughs> Just be told, uh, like you guys know. So, but yeah, I just wanted to share that because that's what I've been hooked on. So I've been watching this channel. Um, and yeah, so hopefully you check it out. Like I said, I can't even pronounce his name. But like I said, I was saying that, uh, there's my friend, Benjamin Keith, ended up uh, meeting a girl who only knows French, and she didn't learn, she didn't learn English, he didn't learn French, but they dated, they got married, and they have kids, so, and they still, I'm pretty sure they still don't know each other's language, but they're still together, so, yeah, I, th I find that interesting, so that's a love story for you, <laughs> like I said, I'm not gonna, it's not like I'm going to hop on the plane to Japan and go meet this guy or anything like that. I'm just saying that I like watching him because of his voice and he is pretty good looking. And it's nice seeing somebody's life in Tokyo, in Japan, who's a guy. Because I've been watching a lot of uh, females from Japan. <clears throat> so now I'm watching a guy. So it's different perspective. So yeah, just wanted to share that. I know he looks a lot older than his age, but he has a nice voice. <laughs> so, just giving you props. <laughs> I'll probably tag him in this too. But yeah, uh, check out his YouTube if you want to know about Japan. And like I said, one day I'm going to get there. And I'm hoping to learn Japanese by the end of next year. Hopefully. So, when I do my Japanese lessons, I might do it with you guys. Because I actually do it on... Uh, YouTube, and actually I'll show you guys the other girl that I watch, so I'm not just promoting a guy, <laughs> so this is how I learned Japanese, is through, uh, Cyber Bunny, <clears throat> and then after this I'm going to go to bed, so this is Cyber Bunny, and she's also a singer too, which is pretty cool. I actually have, uh, uh what song? Uh, young, young and Cute. So they have, she has different songs. She has everything in songs. And she also shows Life in Japan too. So I've been following her for a while. And I'm trying to show you one of her videos. Uh, Where's the song? How to hit 1 million views on YouTube. Oh, well, I haven't seen that video. I mean, I should watch that next. <laughs> Trying to find the song. This is how I learned how the song. Oh, here we go. Uh, Days of the Week. That's another thing you need to learn. I think first you need to know counting for any language. That's what you need to know first is counting. And then everything else kind of comes in together. 
She also has a rap song. <laughs> How to ask for medical help in Jap Japanese. That's a good one to know. Oh, here we go. Counter song. No, that's counters. How to order. Oh, how to say love and... Oh, that's one that I can remember. How to say love and like. Maybe I'll show you guys this one. Um, Zook, Zook. Can't, uh, can't remember now. Yeah, let's play this one together. <coughs> Zuki. <laughs> My name is Cyber Bunny. I love music, bunnies, and teaching you Japanese. In today's lesson, we'll go over how to say love, like, dislike, and hate. It's really easy to learn. Let's do it together. I means love. I did it. Bunny is cute. Suki means like. Suki, that's it. Suki. That's the only one that I know. Suki <laughs> janai means dislike. Janai means not. So put it together. Suki janai. Kirai means hate. Kirai. I can't say that. Some examples. <laughs> I love my boyfriend. Watashi wa boyfriend wo aishitemasu. I like my boyfriend. Watashi wa boyfriend ga suki desu. I dislike my boyfriend. Watashi wa boyfriend ga suki janai. I hate my boyfriend. Watashi wa boyfriend ga kirai desu. JK, I love you. Now you try. I love my boyfriend. Can you do it? <laughs> I can't yet. <laughs> I like my boyfriend. Zuki. I know that word. I'm saying it right. I dislike my boyfriend. Ooh. I hate my boyfriend. And they should be together. <laughs> that was great. See, wasn't it so easy? All right, that's it for today. Make sure you catch the next lesson. Ja, matane. See you next time. <laughs> I hope I don't get copyright for these. What do you want to learn next? Oh, comment uh... below, and we'll feature your comment. In I'll show you guys the other one too before I go to sleep. Uh, trying to find a song. I don't know. Oh, here we go. Here's a song. So this is a song. Uh, counting in Japanese. After the ad. I hope I don't get copyrighted for this. Maybe I'll put the volume down for the ad. <laughs> So yeah, I'm showing you guys how I learn Japanese. There you go. Konnichiwa, Genki. My name is Cyber Bunny. I love music, bunnies, and teaching you Japanese. Kyo no lesson yoroshiku ne? In today's lesson, we'll go over five basic counter words. 
In Japanese, oh, we use music. different counter words for different objects. In English, one cat becomes two cats. <laughs> one tomato, two tomatoes. One fish, twenty fish. To make it plural, we just add the object's plural ending. However, Japanese has no real plural or singular endings. So it's not going to be the same as the English <clears throat> system. So how do you count objects in Japanese? Okay, so when I find the scene, singing one, I'll share it on the community post. But I don't want to get a uh, copyright strike from people, so I hope I don't. But I'm just like, if you guys want to learn Japanese, this is how I learn Japanese. So by watching people like this, they teach you it, and then people's vlog channel who's uh, Japanese, and then through shows that have, what do you call it, uh, subtitles, like Pretty, Pretty Guardian Sailor Moon, and that's how I learned Japanese, oops, so yeah, now I'm gonna have two videos back to back, <laughs> so I wasn't just talking about the guy because he's cute, it's also a good way to learn Japanese is by uh, listening to people talk in the language. So, yeah, and then, like I said, there's lots of, uh, stuff that you could listen to in your sleep, which I used to do, so when I get back, uh, the premium, I'll probably be doing that, but yeah, I just wanted to share, share the YouTubers I've been watching and how I'm learning Japanese, so, hopefully you guys like that. <laughs> So, yeah, uh, when I do lessons, though, I'll probably share it with you guys when I, uh, do it on the computer. Like I said, right now, it's just, uh, casually doing it, but I use her music video, or her music video, her video where she's counting, so I could learn how to count, and then there's other videos that I do search, and then it pops up. I wish I remembered it now. <laughs> I had it written down for the longest time. And then, actually, in one of my videos, I think on YouTube and Facebook, I was talking about uh, COVID vaccine and learning Japanese. And then I stopped <laughs> learning Japanese after that. Because <laughs> I couldn't keep up with it. But I'm going to try again. Because, like I said, I'm determined to go to Japan. Hopefully for my 50th, if not before, I gotta get out of debt first and save money because, like I said, I don't want to just go there just for a week because it takes, like, probably two days just to get there, like, a day. I don't know, to get to Victoria, it's six hours. <laughs> so, one day I'll, I'll calculate all that stuff out. Right now, I'm kind of not trying to jump ahead. I gotta do one thing at a time. But when I go for Shiatsu, I actually talk to them in Japanese. Oh, uh, what is it called now? Can't remember. See, I remember the words, but I can't remember what they mean. So, in the site, I can't remember if that's, I'm pretty sure that's good night or good evening. Or, uh, no, I'm pretty sure it's good night. And then... Doma Doma, I'm pretty sure is thank you or goodbye. I don't remember. <laughs> I know it's one of those. But I know how to say it. Doma Doma means something in Japanese. <laughs> yeah, I'm so tired. I'm like laughing at myself now. So one day I'll learn Japanese, but I'm not going to go to school for it because that's just way too much uh, commitment and then money and then I got to, it's the same reason why I don't go out, I don't have, I can't afford to go out and eat and I can't afford coffee when I go out and stuff like that unless it's payday. So to go to school every day and bring my own lunch with me and with having conditions. Nah, it's too hard to, like, even do just my regular stuff around the house, as you guys see. And then, 
going out is just worse. <laughs> so I hate going out. It's like, oh, it's it's just too much. But I do have to go out on Wednesday because it's payday. So I have to pay off debt. <laughs> pay off debt and buy things. I'm not going to do too much on Wednesday. Well, like I said, on Wednesday, I'm going to go pay off. Go, I mean, go to the SPCA first and drop off the donations, and then I'm going to go to uh, downtown, pay off, which is Hastings, pay off my smokes tab, get more smokes. Then from there, go to the community thrift store, which I can't record in there, I'm pretty sure, because it's too, way too small, so I'd probably get in trouble. Um, I can show you the outside. It's like literally where I go get my smokes. But I've seen uh, they've had like really pretty red dresses before with hearts on it last year. So they might still have it this year. We'll see what they have. And then if not, then Model Express. I'll go, or I might just go to Model Express and just check them out too. We'll see. <clears throat> and then go to the post office. No, oh no, wait, I gotta go to the post office before I go mail off, before I do the smokes, because I gotta go to the bank too. So then, yeah, go to the post office, mail off some gifts. I'm probably not going to mail off everything, like I said. I might just mail off two, and then uh, to you guys, and then wait till the, the weekend, see how much money I have. But now that I'm not taking just a pinch of that, I have a little more money. So, because that right there is what it would have cost. 60 bucks. <laughs> and that's just for a checkup, just for them to tell me. She's old. <laughs> She's old. And if you're not going to put her through treatment, there's no point. So, yeah. That's the other thing, too. So, I do have a little bit more money. And since she's not eating as much, I kind of have a little more money. But not as much money because I still try to get her favorite things. I do want to get her. I was looking at the comfort toy at Walmart, but it's pretty expensive. It's like fifty bucks, but it's like a toy for cats, or they could cuddle with. And I don't know if she would react to it properly. I've been reading the reviews on them. I wish they go on sale, or you could like take it home and try it. <laughs> I don't know if anybody knows what I'm talking about. <clears throat> if you made it this far to this video. But yeah, I'm gonna upload the videos back to back, like I said. But, uh... Oh. I'm so tired, I'm not even hungry anymore. So, I have no... I'll probably end up waking up, like, around 1-ish, knowing it. But I do want to bake... Uh, I like to do the Valentine's Day cookies with you first, because that's been in the fridge for a while. And then, see what I go through that day. <laughs> tomorrow, or I mean, tomorrow is today, so. Because I haven't slept yet, I call it today, and I haven't taken any naps yet, still. So, I think too, it's because whatever's in the medication that I'm taking for my mouth, that's actually, like I said, it's making me, forcing me to stay up. <laughs> So I think that's the other reason why I'm still awake, but I'm like so tired, so. <laughs> <sighs> but, yeah, this is my life. <laughs> so yeah, we'll see, we'll see what I do tomorrow. Like I said, every day is like a game to me. But I'm never bored, I'm never bored. And I really wish I could sleep all day, but Oh no, I can't, because <laughs> this place is a freaking, well, it's not a pigsty, but it's very unorganized, and I still have lots of stuff to declutter and go through before I could, like, start doing other things, <laughs> so I want to get rid of as much stuff as I can so then my storage room is fixed. I'm not putting that much stuff back in there. <laughs> But, yeah, it's just, I gotta let stuff go. 
which I have been, by the way. It's just very difficult to sometimes. So, yeah. On that note, I'm gonna get ready for bed this time. But I hope you guys enjoyed uh, hearing how I learned Japanese. And hopefully, if you guys want to learn Japanese or like another language, you guys will. Uh, this will help you. And I highly suggest do the write the things down. <clears throat> I actually had the thing for the chair written down too. How to say it in Japan, but it fell off and I don't have it anymore. But it does it does really help and I know the skull keeps going in my in my head. So yeah, I'm gonna be uploading these videos back to back. Um check out the YouTubers that I was talking about. I can't pronounce his name. But I'm for now on I'm just gonna say the guy that I have a crush on from Japan. <laughs> That's what I was say, because I don't, I can't pronounce the name. Something with an A, but yeah, he's my new crush. <laughs> it, it seems as though I have a new crush like every week now. It's pretty bad, but a crush is just a crush. Doesn't mean that I'm going to get married and fly to Japan. <laughs> or <clears throat> I'm going to go... I still never heard back from Glenn from Two Shadows. I don't think I ever will. So, which kind of sucks because he's from Vancouver, and we've met several times. But I guess he just doesn't check the messages, which I don't blame him. I don't check. I only check my messages because of YouTube, because a lot of people do contact me through Facebook from YouTube. So if you guys want to find me on Facebook, like I keep saying, I'm under Marie Joseph Mark Martin on Facebook. Um, and that's why I say Mary JM, because there's too many. <clears throat> the reason why I say that too is because my full name is Mary Louise Martin. And there's too many Mary Louise Martins, for whatever reason, that they had to put my Asian name on my ID, so <laughs> I can't tell you guys my Asian name because, uh, well, I guess I can. So my Asian name is An Ming, which I don't. I think it means happiness. So yeah, it's Mary Louise An Ming Martin. So it has to all fit onto my ID card <laughs> because there's just too many Mary Louise. Martin, so that's why I call myself Mary J.M. because there's too many Mary Martins, there's too many Mary Louise Martins, there's too many. So I have to put my Asian name in. And actually my Asian name didn't even fit on my ID, so it's just on. <laughs> it's supposed to be on me. And there's so many ons in, in Asian culture, so it's like, oh. <laughs> but I think they did finally fit it all through, so it does say Mary Louise on Ming Martin. But if you guys are curious, that's what my Asian name is. Uh, <clears throat> for a little while it was a secret, but really isn't anymore. Um, I just will never tell you guys where I live unless you're gonna like send me something. And even then, I have to like know you guys through email before I could do that because yeah I've had stalkers before um another story is I actually had in, in high school <clears throat> we actually there was this guy that used to follow me around all the time I don't know who he was but he was like twice my age and I was like 14 13 14 but he'd always come out of the bushes or he'd be like watching us from the bushes so when when I saw him, I talked to him, <laughs> which probably was not the best thing to do. But yeah, I talked to him, and I stabbed him with my key, putting it in his stomach. So it kind of hurt him, but so he he left me alone after that. But it took that kind of abuse to get him to leave me alone, and I was fourteen, so. I couldn't really do anything because I'd like tell the cops and they're like, oh, well, there's no proof that this guy is stalking you. So it's like, well, what else am I supposed to do? So, and then he finally stopped following me. But yeah, I've always had stalkers. 
That's why, like, when I knew that Ryan was here, I was like, yeah, no, I'm not going to go to UBC and ask everybody, you guys know this YouTuber, Ryan, blah, 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 because then, yeah, that's a stalker. I'm not a stalker. <laughs> I'm not a stalker. So, yeah, but like I said, I've had stalkers all my life, and even with my teeth, no makeup on, just like this, in my pajamas, doesn't matter, I had stalkers. So, yeah, it's weird. Uh, thankfully, I don't really have stalkers anymore, but I did have stalkers a year ago, so that was pretty bad. Uh, I knew who they were, though, so I did handle it, finally, but, yeah, it's just... It's kind of creepy, and that's one reason, too, why I keep saying that's why I don't want kids on YouTube, uh, on my YouTube channel, because I've already had stalkers all my life, and to give them one more outlet, <laughs> yeah, it's not good. So, anyways, be safe, <laughs> and the only stalker that I have is pretty cute. <laughs> that's my, that's my, uh, stalker now. Thankfully. <laughs> so, yeah. On that note, I am going to go to bed, finally, because I am so tired. So, 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 so tired. And I'll see you guys tomorrow. I'll already be asleep by the time both of these are uploaded. So, like, comment, share, subscribe. Like I said, I'm just going to use the washroom and go to bed. So, um, yeah. I'll let you guys know when I go to bed. Because that's how I keep track of how much time I sleep. <laughs> but uh, like, comment, share, subscribe. I'll talk to you guys later after I wake up here on Phantom Stories. Welcome to my haunted world, XXOG.